So then guys, we all know that the Mac Mini is one of the best value Macs out there. Well, in fact, it is the best value Mac out there. Tiny little box we got here, crazy performance, plug it into any screen, keyboard and mouse, and you are ready to go. But what happens if you want some of that mini magic only for say Windows. Well, this here is a brand new PC. This here is the Geekcom A6 and it is small, dinky and stupidly powerful and a great price for what it is. This mini PC only costs just over $400. And like I said, it might be the best value Windows mini PC you can buy right now. Inside the box, you get the mini PC itself, and I'd say a surprisingly small power supply, a HDMI cable, and also you can get a stand for the back of your PC monitor. So that means there's no giant brick, no mess, just clean, compact, and ready to plug in. And when you pick it up, it just feels solid here. The whole chassis is metal with vents all around it. And that premium feeling is amazing. And it only has a little bit of weight to it. Now the footprint of this, it's only 117 millimeters wide, 112 millimeters deep and 49 millimeters tall. That's smaller than a sandwich. And in fact, it's even smaller than the Mac mini that we have right here. So that is quite unbelievable for what you're getting. And also at the same time, you could hide this, say underneath your monitor or something like this, and you probably wouldn't even notice it is there. It is that small. Now, under the hood of this mini PC, we do have an AMD Ryzen 6900HX. So that is an eight core CPU, 16 core threads in here, and up to 4.9 gigahertz. And it also comes with the Radeon 680M integrated GPU based on RDNA 2. Now you can grab the baseline version with 16 gigabytes of RAM and 512 gigabytes SSD inside of this. But you know, the one that I've got right here, well, I've actually got the 32 gigabyte version and I've also got a one terabyte SSD or NVMe SSD inside of this. And with this one here, you can pick even up this version for less than $500 for it. Now, the other crazy thing about this mini PC is that you can do your own upgrades as well. You can actually put up to a two terabyte NVMe inside of this, or even up to 64 gigabytes of RAM. And they're all easy access. There's no soldering or anything like that. Just pop out RAM and also pop out NVMe, you know, cards inside of it and just pop them in. You can do that upgrade as well. So it's really, really great. But also this mini PC does have some great ports on this too you get on this two HDMI 2.0 ports and you've also got two USB-C ports here on the back and you can actually drive up to four 4K monitors. Yes, four monitors, all coming from this tiny little box here that can just sit in the palm of my hand. But like I said, you've also got those USB-C ports and one of them is a full USB 4 port. So you get super fast 40 gigabit transfer speeds. And you can even plug that in to an eGPU. That means you can hook up, say, external graphics cards like I've got right here. This is an AMD RX 7800M, and it suddenly turns this little box into a proper desktop gaming rig. But moving on, you've still also got multiple USB-A 3.2 ports. You've also got a 2.5 gigabit Ethernet port and also a headphone jack too. And this is all laid out lovely across this mini PC. And you've even got an SD card slot as well. I forgot to mention that too. What is awesome. So for something so small, this is brilliant with the amount of ports and also the power that we're getting from this. Now, there's also something I absolutely love about this mini PC from Geekcom. Now, because it's from Geekcom, it literally has zero bloatware on this. None whatsoever. It's one reason why I love Geekcom. So there's no weird pre-installed apps, no antivirus trials, no driver junk software, anything like that. It is literally pure vanilla Windows 11 on this, and it just works straight out of the box. Setup is stupidly easy just to set up Windows 11. No silly registrations or anything like that. It is just great. It just works straight away. But next, let's talk about performance, because I know what you're going to be thinking, well, the Mac Mini is going to be faster. Well, yes, I'll give you that the Mac Mini in single-core performance and multi-core performance is faster than this. 
But for what this is, and remember the price of this is far less than one of these, and like I said, it's an alternative to have a Windows mini PC, I'm going to say this, that the actual performance really surprised me with this. The integrated 680M GPU can actually have assigned to it 16 gigabytes of RAM if you want to do that. So this easily handles out everyday workloads. And even if you play, say, Cyberpunk 2077, and at this benchmark right here at 1080p, with no FSR or frame gem or anything like that, you can easily get over 30 frames per second from this. But like I said, as it's a mini PC, turn on FSR 3.0 and also turn on some frame gen and things like this. This is where things get quite wild. You can actually push 80 frames per second out of this at 1080p. What is incredible really for what this little mini PC gives you. But then if you were to plug in an eGPU into that USB 4 port in the back of this, this is where things get super impressive. Just having standard 1080p on, no FSR or anything like that, like on this one here, I can get over 80 frames per second. But then if I turned on say both FSR and frame generation, on this mini PC and also this eGPU together, I can get over 200 frames per second, yes, 200 in Cyberpunk 2077 at 1080p. And that is insane for a little PC will only just cost over 400 US dollars. So this is the thing what I want to get at. The Mac Mini, I still love it and I think it is great. It's hands down the best value Mac that Apple has ever made out there. But if we're talking about the best value mini Windows PC, I would say the Geekcom A6 is my pick for best value, performance and quality and build and features for what you're getting for the price. And really, like I said, for Windows PC, you just cannot beat it out there for value. And if you do want to check out the Geekcom A6, make sure you check out all the details that are in the bottom of this video, because I definitely think this is an amazing buy to get. And with Black Friday coming up, there's some fantastic deals for this too. So definitely check that out. But on that note as well then, guys, what do you think of the Geekcom A6? If you were to get a mini Windows PC, is this something that you would think about to also have on your desk as well as your Mac Mini? Well, let me know in the comments below. And on that note as well, guys, if you've enjoyed watching this video, please also make sure that you press the like button. If you want to hear the latest Apple news, reviews, and comparisons, make sure you subscribe to this channel and also hit that notification bell too. Until next time, guys, I'll see you really soon. Take care. Bye-bye.